Okay, so here we are on a short tutorial to teach you guys how to download the repository. So let me just create a new folder. Okay, I'll just call this um, game note server. Alright, so this is where we want to put our server. So if you haven't logged into Qune before, this is a time chance for you to log into Qune. QNMercury.com Alright, so it's just gamenote.qnhg.com HG for Mercury. Alright. Qune is not exactly the fastest uh, thing to use, but we'll bear with it because it's free. No. Alright, for those of you who are interested, this is Internet Explorer 9. Definitely not worth trying, it's not nice to use at all. Okay, so once you go to Qune, you will see that um, there are many repositories you can browse. Okay, so the one that I'm using is gnnet.trunk. You can browse all. And this is all the repositories we have. Okay, so the GNNet is our project, and we go to trunk. So in future, we have many projects and many repositories. So you can just choose the one you want to download. So this is the clone URL, all right? If you don't want to copy, you just click on this clipboard, and it will be copied to your clipboard. All right. Then now, assuming you have installed. Qn client, which is a Tortis HG with Qn extension, you should see Tortis HG here, All right? So you can straight away just clone, click on clone, All right? So right-click on the folder you want to copy it to Tortis HG and click on clone. You should see this screen. All right. So the destination path will be this one, which is this folder, whereas the source path you want to take from your clipboard right so control V and that's it and you can choose to clone to various uh, revision or whatever but if you leave everything as the default it will clone to the latest revision so just click clone right and if you have done everything correctly um, okay ask me to upgrade to a later version but maybe no, not now all right so for me, I have typed in my username and password already, but if it asks you for a username and password, just type in your email and the password you use to log in to your Qm client. Alright? Uh, yeah, to log in to Fongpass and Qm.com. Yeah, so it's the same password that I typed into here just now. Alright, now you're going to ask me how am I going to open this project. So let me fire up NetBeans. Project. Okay, so you just because the folder is a NetBeans project, you just use open project, go to desktop, go to GNN server, which is here, and click open project. Alright, and yeah. So you should see everything here. Alright, and this is the server. And if I want to run the server, I just click play. And it should run. Alright? Alright, and that's all to kill. Thank you.